Alright, so finally this has happened. The DJI updated their Mavic 3 Pro and this is the most important update yet. Why? Because, well, basically there are two new functions that really matter, which are you can now see through these cameras sideways while you fly in whichever camera mode you fly or uh, you can use D-Log M on the 7X camera, which means that now you can finally have the same color profile throughout the, all three cameras. So in this video, let's check it out. Let's check out this vision assist function and let's check out those D-Log M profiles. Currently we are in air and this is what we see. We see the bridge. But what if I would say that you can see even more? Let's tap on this icon and now let's tap on this icon. Right? No, no, that's the wrong icon, sorry. <laughs> let's tap on this and this and this. And here we have the camera. This is using the... And if you hold the button, you lock it, you lock the view. So now let's lock the view so we can see how, where we go sideways. And let's capture the shot with some cars going over the bridge. And I can safely see that I am not crashing into anything because, all right, here's a car. Let's try to catch it because I was able to see it in my tiny window right there that I'm safe just like that right now I would be kind of freaking out because I don't know where the flag is but because I know it now because of that little screen right there I can finally capture my sideways 17 millimeter shots with confidence which is amazing and then, of course, the 7X D-Log M is now available, which is incredible. Now we are capturing in 7X D-Log M. Let's move on closer to the bridge. Oh, just a second. Uh, there's a woman walking there. I actually want the other side of the bridge. Yeah, let's lock on this one, this side. Let's get real close to the bridge. We can get way more closer. Maybe let's turn on the cine mode because on the 7X, this mode makes a lot of sense. If you want to capture something that's moving really slowly and if you want to capture it moving smoothly. Uh, my exposure is way underexposed. Whoa, right now, if I wouldn't have that tiny camera on my side, I would freak out because that tram took the whole space of the screen. So yeah, now all the cameras have the same. Oh, oh, I want to find a shot. That's a shot right there. Now all the cameras have the same uh, freaking um, color profile, which is insane and amazing amazingly insane what else can I say it's incredible this is captured with the 7x camera feeling safe because I know that I'm going sideways and I'm not running into anything I'm over water right now this is amazing I love it yeah, now, now capturing with the 7X is way more, uh, like, I feel, I feel safe. I feel safe because I know that on that side right now, there's nothing there. I can easily, quickly glance my eye to the side and just take a look at the view. Amazing. That is 
the new update an amazing update for the Mavic 3 Pro uh, I don't know if it's on the Mavic 3 Classic and Mavic 3 if it is and it's pretty cool if not then well sucks to be you <laughs> yeah but the Mavic 3 Pro the, this new update is amazing the D-Log M on the 7X camera was very welcome because well without it it's you cannot really get that that similar looking images well you can get similar looking images in post but it's way easier when the color profiles are the same so uh, that's amazing and this vision assist system is is incredible it looks really it, it works very well I really was able to glance at the screen and see that I'm flying sideways and there's nothing there and I can concentrate on my shot and get it and uh, not worry about crashing my drone into something. So uh, yeah, an amazing update. If you haven't yet updated your Mavic 3 Pro or if this update comes to the Mavic 3 Classic and the Mavic 3 regular one too, then update those two as well. So yeah, thank you for watching and see you in the next video.